guys, so welcome back. I am now heading to my hospital. Hydroxychloroquine is also having a beneficial effect on patients who have coronavirus infection. I myself treat non-COVID patients, but I have used hydroxychloroquine in the past. Increases the intracellular concentration of zinc. It prevents the replication of the coronavirus. Overall, disease ke manifestations become hone lagenge. You cannot directly use hydroxychloroquine to prevent the infection. Number one cheese, may I ask you all to as a warning, please do not self-medicate with hydroxychloroquine. I know that in India, this drug generally gets us to get it without a prescription. As you know, in the human body, mein, we have a heart and the heart has an electrical system. The electrical system needs to maintain a certain rate and rhythm. What happens if this goes down or if it goes up? The overall pumping capacity of the heart changes. Blood is flow nahi ho pata because the whole overall rate of the heart has changed. And how it functions? Kitne rate se pump hona chahiye, kitne tezi se pump hona chahiye, ye sare alter hote hai hydroxychloroquine se. When you look at a ECG, ECG is actually a map of how the electricity is flowing. Electricity will start flowing slower than usual. This can have a massive effect on the flow of blood per minute. Oxygen will not reach the in the body. Our organs they thrive on oxygen that we get from the blood that is circulating. Hydroxychloroquine, if you are giving patient to any patient, monitoring is necessary. Monitoring is very important. You have to monitor the ECG continuously. Second thing, you have to monitor how much oxygen is going. So if you do not have this monitor, which I'm sure nobody has at home, then do not self-medicate with hydroxychloroquine. My purpose was to make this video so that everyone knows what hydroxychloroquine can do. Apart from what we already know. If you want to know something, post comment section some questions in the comment section. I will try to answer it in the whole process.